well, Augie, nice to finally sit down and have a conversation with you. Tell us a bit about yourself and what you'll be doing with us this season. Well, I'm obviously head kit man here all the short time doing the first team. Um, originally, I'm from Essex, so it's a, it's a move for me, um, which is good getting used to the area and that. Um, but no, my job is basically head, head pack washer, really, is what I do. So um, just sorting the boys out with kit every day, looking after the football's equipment and everything, just making sure everyone's got everything they need so that they can go out and do their job without yeah. worrying. And you've been involved in kit management for a while. What was it that initially got you into it? Well, yeah, I've been involved. This is my 10th season in football now. Um, it was just through knowing people, really. Um, at the time, I got, I got into it with Charlton Athletic through being a supporter and knowing the then manager, Chris Powell, quite well. And um, because I knew him, he got me into football, into the job, done a full year there voluntarily. And then, yeah, just went from there. You spoke about knowing people as well. You also know the manager here, Danny Searle yep. from West Ham. What's his relationship like with you and how's he been since you've joined? Oh, he's been brilliant. Um, yeah, can't say a bad word about Danny. I've obviously worked with him before at West Ham, um, at a time in the academy there. He was under 16s manager. I looked after the under 18s and under 16s on match day. Also done a tour with Danny in Japan, which was, which was good. And we went out there and won that with West Ham's under 19. So. Um, yeah, no, it's brilliant. And the chance to come up to work with him again, jumped on it. It was a you know great, great group they've got here. To be fair, you spoke about great group. So what does, what are the players like here? What they've been like? Players, players have been brilliant with me. Um, yeah, from day one they've been superb. It seems like a good group here. Um, I think the staff as well. It's a good, it's a good core of staff that they've got. You know, and Mike, and obviously George, the physio. Um, but the boys, yeah, they're brilliant. It seems like a good group. I'm looking forward to just getting the season started now and, you know, celebrating some proper wins with them. And just finally, what are your personal targets and team targets for the season as well? Obviously, I, I always try and be positive. So I go into every game saying we're going to win. No matter who we're playing, whatever, whatever the situation, I'll go into every game saying we're going to win. So on that basis, I think we're going to win the league. Um, that's um, if that happens. But um, no, generally, Mainly from my point of view, it's just I don't want the boys to have any worries kit wise either. So, my job on a match day is to make sure they go out there when they cross the white line, they're not thinking, Oh, I wish I had this, I wish I had that. I like to make sure they're catered for everything, they've got everything they need so they can go out there, do their job. And I've played my part, you know, my small, my small part in that, you know, to help them. You win with a shot. For more information, click the link in description. Click here for the next video and click here to subscribe.